Okay, so we're gonna do a mixed review. That mixed review works for fourth advanced four students, uh, even fifth grade students, um, probably six. But just for fifth, that would be good. So I'm gonna show you the exercises. The idea is that you try to do it by yourself, and then I'm gonna just do it quick so you can check your answers. So you can pause the video, copy the exercise you need, do your best and then you can check the answers okay I'll do it really quick because that's a review I have a previous videos explaining each of these exercises but this is a review so you can see the explanation really quick and the idea is that you try by yourself first okay I'll start by this here is one fifth times five just simplify the five the answer is one it's very simple but when you are adding this is a one fifth plus five this is like five over one you can do it as a fraction and will be uh or you can just one fifth is 0 0.2 plus five is 5.2 or 5.2 or it could be 26 over five or 26 over five is you do it as a fraction so this is uh, inverse multiplicative property so that will be equals one simplify this with this this with this that will be one this is the same thing you simplify all this that will be one so here i have multiplication by 100 when it's a decimal just move two spaces here 118 that's it times by a thousand one two three zero so one two and three when you don't have anything you put the zero two thousand three hundred and fifty so here some student might try to do it as a fraction because visually that's what you try to do first but if you look close closely to the exercise 28 divided by 7 is 4 4 plus 6 is 10 the answer it will be 10 here inverse multi multiplicative the same thing this with this this with this the answer is 1 so in those two now you need to find a number 6 times 8 48 minus something is 31 so that will be 17 okay here 28 minus 15 I'll be 13 this one 81 divided by 9 is 9 minus something it will give you 2 as an answer so here will be a 7 this times this 121 minus 21 it will be 100 um, so those ones you should do it with a you can I mean the idea is you do it by yourself but I would just do it with calculator because I don't want to like waste the time too much uh, so, uh, okay. I don't have also space so this one will be 5040 so this one you just subtracted it. it will be 9981 9981 here here you divide it, 7 divided by 4 it will be 1, 9, and then a 6, 24 at the end, 4 times 6 is 26. And this one the same thing, 95 times 816, that will be 77,520. Okay, that's a mixed review, I, I hope that helped you. God bless you and just keep practicing math. See you guys.